Hey guys, how are you doing? This is James and today I'm going to show you how you can achieve cyberpunk look using Adobe Premiere Pro as you have seen in the intro section. This effect is very simple and we are going to use a effect called VR Glow to achieve this effect. So let's go to Premiere Pro. This is the clip that we want to use for this demonstration. So the clip is very simple. You can see the color is looking good but we want to introduce a cyberpunk vibe on this clip. To apply the effect we have to go to effect section if you don't have this section you can go to window and then click effects then this panel will appear and search for vr glow click and drag this effect to your clip and go to effects control panel and again if you don't have this panel go to window and then effects control so here is the effect and you can see there are some parameters that we can control to achieve this effect first parameter is luma threshold luma threshold will control how much light we want to put on our highlight section so here is the video if i just decrease this threshold you can see a lot of light here and there on this clip but we don't want that we want to control this lightness right so just increase it maybe uh, 0.60 and under that you will see glow radius glow radius will control the featherness of this effect if i decrease the number you can see the effect have been applied on a smaller portion of this video and if i just increase this number the effects have been blending very well with this clip so i am just keeping it maybe 60 and under that glow brightness will control how much light you want to put on this section so if we just increase it just like crazy then this section will just blow out but we want to keep it very natural and for that we have to keep it maybe 1.5 1.5 looking good and under that there are three sections and these sections are very important for achieving that cyberpunk look last section is tint color tint color will control which color we want to put on this highlight section let me select red color because i think red color will look good on this clip nothing is happening right so uh, to see the color appearing on your screen you have to click on this mark box so if i just click on this checkbox we can see red color is appearing on this section and glow saturation will control how much color you want to introduce on this clip i am just keeping it one and let's adjust this parameter okay looking good so our highlight section is uh, looking good and we can see red color has been introduced on highlight section if you want to have separate color in the shadow section then you can just go to lumetri color if you don't have lumetri color you can go window then lumetri this panel will appear and go to color wheel and match and from this section just click and drag this section to whichever color you like i like teal color and i'm just clicking and dragging it towards still so it is looking good if i just disable this effect you can see our video was just like that and after applying this effect we can see we have uh, achieved actually a very good looking cyberpunk look right so that's all for today hope you have enjoyed this video if you have enjoyed this video and learned something new you can just give me a thumbs up and you can subscribe to this channel to show some love and you can write whatever you want in the comment section below what kind of video you want to watch next time i'll catch you guys in the next time until then goodbye <laughs>